Hey pilots, today we're doing how to get the best flying quad in eight minutes or less. Now with the presets in beta flight, it is very easy to basically have a really good flying quad and you don't even need to know how to tune anymore. I mean, I, I was never the best at it, but uh, it's the thought that counts. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put all the tips, all like, not tips, just all the information into one video so that way you know what to do. Um, so these links here are gonna be in the description and then you're gonna go ahead and click that link, right? You're gonna click it right here. Go to important, make sure, yeah, click this one right here. Scroll down, download the installer. It will, it will remove your last beta flight if I'm correct. Now, my quad's already plugged in. We're gonna go ahead, hit connect. We're gonna make sure we're, we're gonna see which one we're on. I'm on 4.3.0 now. I'm pretty sure this is an old beta flight. That I have not updated this flight controller, so uh, Foxier F7 uh, 22 V2. Uh, now we're gonna go ahead CI CLI bootloader BL. Now it's a bootloader. Foxier, yep, yeah, that's correct. Um, RC3. Now we're gonna go ahead and load online. Flash firmware. Erasing. Now I'm probably gonna be skipping a lot of the downloads and whatnot in this video. Um, because personally, like you, know, like, you guys can sit here for it, but <laughs> I'm not going to be really talking about much. Just kind of wait for it to finish. Um, I did start a timer. We're at one minute and 40 seconds right now. So we have eight minutes to play with, or now like going on six, but yeah, I'll, I'll probably just clip it. Um, oh, well, I'll let this one go through. Uh, go ahead and explain these other set, uh, things. Now the presets I'm going to be using are the Karate. Or, I don't know how to print it. Yeah, it's Karate. Uh, 5 inch success, race 500. Um, and I'll get into another thing about that um, from my buddy Leanne. Uh, he told me about some filters that I should use along with it. But, okay, we're done. Okay, yep. we're going to disconnect. Plug it back in. There we go. Apply custom defaults. Bam. Now, receiver, oh, pit tuning. Actually, gonna go like this. Some little things I like to do. Now we're gonna go ahead and go to the presets. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and click this one, G Shot 600, and then we're also because I use Ghost 500 Hertz, uh, D Shot 6, Ghost 500. I kind of want to change it to 300, but I mean I'll try it. Um, yeah, that's okay. Pick three. Now, the, the filters I was talking about before were these array filters right here, and my buddy Leanne said that he tried these out and it, it flew better, and it's actually meant to go with this. I think, I'm not too sure, I will do, I'll do a video, like a part two to this, that kind of uh, tries a lot of these things out, um, just to see, I mean, it never hurts to try. Um, now we're going to go ahead and apply, save and rebuke, and now it's applying it. Okay. Connect. Now I will have to, you know, see which UART I'm using and all those little things. Um, add this. Um, where else is it? Flip over after crash and then beeper. There we go. Save. And then for OSD. I go just J box. Man, this is this is getting close. We're already at like almost five minutes. Okay, throttle position. Uh, RSSI. Where is it? Craft name. Okay. There we go. There we go. Okay, and then battery, battery voltage, okay, there, and go ahead and put that there, boom, 
let's say font manager. Uh, we're gonna go clarity, and then upload font. You can see it right there in the background. Okay, okay, we're on a good time. Good time overall. Okay. This should be set up in theory. All right. And besides that, uh, I believe I have to be on 4K, 8K, 4K. Okay. And now, make sure for BL Heli, you're going to want to make sure you're on the latest 32 uh, suite. Um, and then to make sure you're getting the best performance out of your ESCs, you're going to want to go ahead and download this test code. It makes it a little bit less noisy for the FC to read. Now, I already have it. Now, so this was a little part I didn't catch because Joshua Barbell's video is very detailed, but I kind of skipped this part. I didn't even realize it until I was talking to my friend Ryan. Uh, where is it? Now, I run the Redux. Redux 32, yes, sir. Now, we're going to go ahead and show one folder. Nope. Go ahead, BL32. Um, Now, I already have it here, which I'm just going to go ahead and delete this one. Uh, hex files. Now, you have to drag it over into the hex files for it to like, recognize it, okay? Okay, let's get a smoke stopper. Never hurts to make sure. Because I have not even poked in the build. Yep. Hopefully, it's good. Yep. Okay, now we're at. Ooh, we are cutting it close. Right, right about seven minutes okay read setup okay now just to double check and confirm to myself uh redux 32 f4 nano uh right. yeah that's spot on um hit okay esc flash yes flash selected now i'm gonna pause it i'm gonna pause stop because we're starting the timer okay Reading setup, good, good, good. Now I'm gonna be using 48, correct, correct. Uh, do make off, we're gonna go bump this up to 28 timing. Uh, telemetry on, everything is correct, and boom. Right at, wait, wait, yes, you're right. Okay, and right at seven minutes and 45 seconds, you will have a really nice flying quad, if I'm being honest. I mean, I test hovered, um, my own another quad that i had set up now it flew like probably perfect out of the box if i'm being honest i mean i was just kind of flying around my yard just doing split s's just trying to get a feel for the tune and it flew really good and probably better than any of my other tunes that or my tune that i released before um so yeah i strongly encourage anyone uh that you know just doesn't want to sit through you know like a really long video or read definitely check this video out I'm, I'm trying to be as helpful as I can I have the steps here um, also to go along you know all the steps that um, you know I'm, I'm just trying to help everyone that I can uh, so uh, yeah I think that's everything so I'm gonna go ahead and edit this video and post it up and if anyone has any questions go ahead and comment down below I, I do not mind trying to answer any of them to my best knowledge that I can and then, uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy. See you guys later. But, oh, also, let me know how it goes with this tune. Um, it's not even my tune. It's a, you know, it's from Betaflight. So, yeah, um, from what I've heard, this is definitely one of those tunes that has been already tested by a lot of the community and has been very good for a lot of people. Um, so I don't see why, you know, it should be bad or anything. Um, there are tons, tons of other tunes here that you guys can tr definitely try out. Um, yeah, there's community ones, there's official tunes. So yeah, let me know how it goes for you guys and uh, I'll try to help you guys as best as I can. Catch you guys later. Bye.